Hello and welcome to the first ARCA race of the week, the new week here at Thompson. Pretty excited, but pretty nervous for this one. I don't have very much experience at Thompson in general, and this is pretty tough. We've had a couple of tough weeks here in a row. Um, we had Langley and then Talladega, which is, you know, I don't know if tough is the right word, but probably accurate to say it's tough to consistently finish well. So that's probably accurate. And then here we got Thompson, which is going to be quite a handful. In fact, I might have to be silent here for a moment. Okay, here comes your first time black. Just going to try to get a decent lap in. Then push a little harder, maybe. One more lap. Uh, I really went wimpy that last corner, though. Pushed it on throttle and I held on to it. It in too low. That's a little bit better. That's not great. I really wanted to at least be in the fives. Oh boy. That's okay. Never really quite got into the fours like a handful of guys are there. Um, I guess that's pretty good company. Only a couple spots away from Larry Pace there until he gets the pull here in a second. <laughs> Dropping just a little more. Tons of people that we know in this race, as is typical. I just gave a good luck all in the chat. Just cover my bases. <sighs> we'll see. We'll see how it goes. I think I'd be thrilled with a top ten, to be honest. Such a strong field. We're just a. We're going to be the row ahead of Gavin there as of right now. Gavin Lemons. Uh, we also got Gavin Ropchan in here as well. He's starting P15. And then Armed for Gaming, Austin down there. That's his YouTube channel. Just a ton of people we know. Um, in fact, was he in the practice or? Okay, he was in the practice. The guy that I just raced Street Stocks at Southern National <laughs> with was in the practice. But I guess he uh, either didn't make top split or... See, 3.1, he might not have made top split, but he was in there as well, which is kind of funny. And we're just waiting on Lewandowski, actually. He's got one lap in, probably going to get a second lap in and, and uh, usurp us. Outside might be the place to be, though. Because uh, I think that might be. That's the end of the session. Do -do -do. That's Shane. Good luck, gonna be tough. So, yeah, maybe outside's where I want to be anyway. Seems like I think that might be the place to pass. So I'll probably go be going for that. I just want to survive though. Um, top ten would be fantastic. Just surviving would be fine too. Cause this could be this could get really rough. It'll be hard to just stay out of the wall the whole event. Cause it's it's wobbly even on the straightaways. It's pretty wobbly. And kind of like Langley, I think uh, part of what you want to do here is just not overdrive it. You got to break pretty hard into the corners if you want to uh, slow down enough and not overdrive it. Hey, that's not a bad person to have in front of us. Mitch, he's always great on the short track, so maybe he could open some doors. Got some good company around me. Hopefully that means we'll have a bubble of safety. <laughs> that assuming they won't have issues themselves, or maybe I'm going to be the dangerous one. I hope not. Side by side is going to be pretty tough, man. 45 laps. I 
Let me just not do something dumb. That sounds nice. Not dumb. This isn't a third gear start, is it? Ooh, I'm scared, man. I think it's second gear. Yeah, this is... Man. I feel like I say it a lot. One left to we, like, that this is going to be tough, but we've had tough races on the schedules lately. Like with Arca. Again, going back to Langley, that was very tough. And here again, it's going to be rough to just be side by side, I think. About to go green, stay focused. All right, here we go. Are you ready? Be ready. Ice car is off. Be ready. <laughs> At least green, not, green, apparently. Green, car inside, clear. Scott gets clear of us, that's fine. Inside, go high. What are we doing? What's happening down there? There's a car on the low side. Clear inside. I don't know what happened down there, but somehow Woo! survived. The big one. I don't know what happened. Yeah, I was trying to give you some room there. Definitely cool. gonna have to look back at that later. I have no idea what happened, but I saw Scott having to give room, and I gave him as much room as humanly possible. Somehow made it through without even getting touched, so I guess that's good. Sure, I'm not overdriving. Kind of want to. Oh! Careful. Kind of want to do a little bit of cut down there, but you'll be very, very careful on the throttle. Because uh, the banking kind of flattens out right there, and it can get real spinny on you real fast, so. Just going to try to be consistent. Gavin is back there, though. Sure, he's not going to want to wait behind me forever if I'm being slow. No idea what the tires are going to do, if anything. It might be one of those heat situations. But I'm far too concerned with just hitting my marks. <laughs> the tires right now, anyway, so... Oh, man, this is... I'm going to be in pain. Oh, oh, oh. after this one. Slowing down. Wrecking one and two. Holy Just be patient. Oh no, Gavin got in that one. Hey, Something happened back there. Go in way over your head you it ain't Mitch is not happy. You're in the top ten. Time to position. Thank you, Eric. I'm inclined to believe him. <laughs> yeah, I'm to let you go that guy knows his short tracks. So if he's angry about nah, something, someone probably didn't do something right. Patient. All right, we are in the top ten. I'm very happy with that. Kevin Rapchan behind us, moving forward. Good for him. He was back at 15th or so, I think, starting out. Oh, that's Gavin coming out of the pits. Hey, leader, whenever you want me to, just tell me to run, and I'll go bottom side for you. Inside. Clear. I don't have to worry about him holding his line. Could you please? I appreciate it. 21.4. That sucks for Gava, though. He was right behind us. Possibly could have come in uh, past us at some point. This is reminiscent of Langley, actually. Where he wrecked out and then came out on track yeah, right behind me. Inside. Clear inside. 
Just I trying to be consistent here. here. Seven getting a little loose. He's fighting through it though. Trying not to light up the rears like the seven is. Just I feel like I'm gonna need those tires not to be really hot later on. I feel like it's only gonna get worse and worse if I start sliding around everywhere. And I want to be able to get back on the throttle. Especially if I'm cut down on the exit of corners. And it gets as loose as it does already. Don't want to tempt fate on that one. So I'm just going to try to stay back here, be consistent. Not drive over my head. They are a little bit faster than me, I think. I don't think I'm much faster. I mean, I qualified, what, 11th? Oh, somebody's having trouble down there. Don't come up on track or anything. I was looking at him and not paying attention to what I was doing. I was super worried that he was going to slide up on track or something, and I needed to just focus on what I was doing. So, so much for not heating up the tires. That definitely did that. He did a little bit of that. Can't tell if Scott just got loose or if he got a tap from behind. Really not the cars to be uh, tapping people from behind on unless you actually intend to wreck them. I'm getting on the brakes enough. I have a bad habit of not getting enough on the brakes. Especially when I start getting in race mode. Gotta slow this thing down enough. Approaching halfway here, but not quite there yet. Almost drove, overdrove that corner. Hopefully, got it slowed down. Later, you're going up the bottom. Top. Top. Uh, All right, right. It's kind of tough to say, like, do you want top or bottom? Well, it's kind of like middle? <laughs> Both? So you kind of enter middle and then kind of go high and then enter lowish. Very, very interesting track here, just Thompson. I don't know if there's quite anything exactly like it, especially not on iRacing, I would say. Uh oh. Is that a position slow car down low, or is that that's I think that's just Mitch. In case someone I shouldn't be finishing ahead of, but am because of some sort of accident. I said I'd be happy with the top 10. Oh my god. Larry just wrecked someone. Oh my god. That's what it sounds like. We are P9. Justin survived. Oh, we're an eighth. Wow, just, just do me a solid. Hold your brakes and wreck that top of the damn track. Okay. We have been lucky. Some very people, very uh, talented people, having trouble as well. I'm Jack right there, and I, I wobbled. I'm sorry. Not a guy that makes very many mistakes, so it's noteworthy when it happens. Do I not finish the Oh, Jack has a meatball flag. He has to pit. It's there's way too much race yeah, left. That's like the last two laps of the race, but other than that, no, yet to pit. Is that gonna be another spot for us? That sucks. I don't want to gain spots that yeah, way. It's great gaining positions. Don't get me wrong. 
That sucks. It really does. We got Lewandowski lap down behind us. Yeah, my braking points had to be really early. My tires were on fire. He might need to uh, pass us because he's got people for Fire's position really around him, I think. Thank you. This is not for position, this is a lap car ahead of me. Bottom. Is he getting out of the way or no? Just going to the bottom? I don't know, I can't tell what he's trying to do. I guess he's letting me by? Clear. Didn't quite tell at first because he was kind of half doing it. There he goes. Okay. Woo! This is tough. This is very tough. Still got a little while to go, too. Plenty of race to be had. I think Lewandowski might be faster than me. He might be being patient for me. Hard to say. Might need to be cutting lower out of four. Justin, thank you. When you get here, I got you. Got top. Yeah, I'll go top. Can I get me here? Eighth place. That is very nice. That's better than my car number. And well within my goal of top ten. Yeah, I'm not fighting for nothing, so I'm just getting out of everybody. Very, very possible to throw it away though if I'm not careful. So. I have to still be careful on the throttle, make sure I'm slowing down enough on entry. Still gotta get around this place a handful more times. Do I let... do I... I mean... I don't know who the next person behind me is. I don't want to give up a bunch of time, but they are in a much closer battle than I am. So is it... Should I be letting him by? I mean, he has over half a second still to Gavin behind him. I think if he gets closer, maybe I'll uh, give it to him. That lap was at 21.4. My bad. Oh, you're good. I'm letting these guys go. Whew. Ten to go. Great job. Ten to go. Do we have any more surprises in store? You go low, Levin. I want the outside. I feel like I'm hitting my marks pretty well at the moment. Don't, don't, don't. <laughs> Easy now on the throttle. The gap ahead is now 2.6. I do think it has benefited me not to light up the rears as much. I could I could have been pushing harder from the start on exits. But instead I kinda just was extra careful so I didn't loop it. And extra careful. Not to introduce too much heat to the tires, and it feels like I'm still getting good run off. I'm not sure if that's really a thing people are dealing with. But at least it's not something, Just not an issue I'm having. Five. So that's always good. Less issues is good. Lewandowski has pulled away from Gavin a little bit. 
so I don't have to feel as guilty if I'm holding them up, I guess. We had someone sliding. It's the 23 lap car. Watch out for him here in case his tires are really hot. Never know if someone's gonna loop it again after things get really slippery after a slide. Five laps to go. Let's bring this thing home. Isn't a fast repair supposed to be a car? Oh, my hands. <laughs> Here's your uh, mandatory out of my hands from me at a short track. Everything but the tire. Ah, okay. I was going to say, the car's driving like shit. Does that make sense? <laughs> Can you let me go, 22? Yeah, I got you. Alright. So, uh, Lewandowski's on my bumper. Does he, is he gonna have to get by? I don't know. I ought to just go faster so he doesn't have to get to my bumper, huh? Thank you. Two laps left. The gap in front yep, is yep. now 2.7. Last lap. Four to go. P8. Any last lap shenanigans upcoming? You've just done a 21.5. 23, almost got some last lap wall. Good race, Connor. Thanks for running me clean. You finished yeah, up there. Yeah, that was fun, man. Good race. I was dead in the water at the end. And we did it! Oh my gosh, I am proud of myself for that one. I definitely thought I was going to wreck at some point. But I uh, got some luck. Managed to hold it steady and get a P8. Very happy with that. And a very, very tough field. Alright, gonna pull on over. Good race, good win. All right. So we are incidents. We got people calling people out. Huh. Let's see, we got. Like, he feels really bad, you can tell. Lots of apologies. 92, 92. I'll post that. My tires are never good. Looks like Justin was on the right rear. Gavin on the right rear. You see, I was easy on the right rear. And I think it paid off. Oh my gosh. This is like the first time I've ever actually planned to do something and it kind of worked. <laughs> Everyone else on the right rear. I was able to uh, be a little easier on it and ended up equal and uh, kept it clean too. Even if I, you know, I wasn't the winner or anything. The winner probably, people that finished ahead of me definitely had different tires, probably looking worse, quote unquote. But um, you give me hot rear tires and I'm probably spinning out. So <laughs> for me, I'm very happy that I didn't do that to myself. Anyway, what Justin, happened out here? Fucking grinded Black the wall like a skateboarder. Seven. Yeah. It's into the 20. <laughs> what, what, what the fuck, dude? That's crazy. <laughs> That's gonna be good. Oh, here we go. Thumbnail and a half. The hilarious just in it for cotton, but the content. Justin's doing the broad slide on a skateboard. So, oh, just uh, looks like uh, Shane maybe not able to get it slowed down in time for that rack. Probably couldn't even see it. Not much you could do there. I, I, just, I, I walked 
trying to make sure I didn't right rear jack. And oh yeah, let's I see what I did to get around that. Jack breaking zone, so I was going in way too hot and yanked it down off the wall. Into him. That sucked. Major ass. So we had Scott in front of me. That's an I just remember seeing someone getting sideways right there. And I'm like, I gotta go up. Actually, I don't even know if I ever saw it. I just I saw Scott moving up, so I had to give him plenty of room. And then I'm, I'm not even on the banking anymore, really. It kind of like flattens out up there. Oh, 15's gotta hold the brakes. That sucks, man. Good racing yeah, I was trying to keep yeah you gotta know better than that. that. That's pretty bad. Entering as high as you guys did, so I ended up eating up my tires. What else? Like, oh, Andre. Oh, five. Yeah, that's so, Jeremy, this gets loose on everything. Well, that's what I was running. Oh, the seven wrecks another person. So that's two now. Yeah, they were getting a higher entry, and I was just in up the ball. Here, it's like two I people. Every time I entered up there in three. And then we had to be careful with this one as well. Wow, Mitch almost got me. Oh, wow. He even started rolling again. He didn't hold it there. Almost got me. He comes down and gets... Gavin, though, that's what happened to Gavin? Man, you gotta not do that. <laughs> oh my god. You gotta hold it up there, man. I'm sure he apologized to Gavin for that. It's probably just heat of the moment. But that kills Gavin's car. Almost killed me. Kills Gavin's car. I'm sure he was mad. And probably not thinking. So that's why he just rolls down the track in front of everybody. Who knows, maybe that's just what he had to do. Like, people were going to start plowing into him regardless, I don't know. I don't think that's what you want to do, though, but... Anyway, moving along. 20's got damage, that thing's probably not driving quite right. And this is tough enough to drive already. 14, loose on X again? Yeah, I'm telling you, it's that, uh... The banking that flattens out right here, and you can get on that seam too, and that's where it really gets unsettled too, if you get too hard on the throttle. Pretty rough. And then here's what Larry is apologizing for probably. Yep. Oh man. So like he said, he got into the wall. That's what I was talking about, even on the straightaways it's wobbly. So what happens is he gets into the wall, and then the ARCA car, when you pull it off the wall, it, it's, I don't know, it's like st pulling something sticky off the wall or something. When you let go, you about punch yourself in the face. <laughs> and uh, he pulls it off the wall, gets uh, who, two guys that are faster than me is who that is in front. We've got Jack, Justin, yeah, and this is where Justin... Tony Hawk said, I think. Sick, dude. <laughs> he had that special bar full so he could do a sick move. <laughs> That's funny. I mean, wrecking's not funny, but... That he was able to keep going and get a top five after turning his car into a skateboard is pretty nice. Loose on exit there, too. Dale Earnhardt's in the wall. Oof. Smacks it hard, too. Because that's what I was talking about before up there. Not only do you get, like, the dust and rubble up there, it, like, flattens out, and you just get... There's no way to turn the thing. Unless you're already turning, apparently. As we found out right there. Okay, and Rob Chang gets the wall. Oh, no! Did he recover from that? Okay, great. He was having a great run, and he ended up having a great finish, too. And ninth place is the 24 car. I thought for a second that he lost it there, though. That was scary. And that's going to be it. So I'm very pleased with that, uh, being able to...
keep it clean, stay out of trouble, get a top 10, beat my car number, and uh, have ourselves a nice finish in a very tough race. Not very many zeros out here. And I was thankfully able to be one of them, so that's going to do it, though, for first race of the week here in ARCA. And uh, I hope you enjoyed. I had a fun time. Stinks that uh, some people uh, I like to root for had some trouble, but some other guys did really well, too. Gavin up here. Scott, Justin. Lots of guys, so that'll do it. Hope you have a good one. See ya.